unless your name is Spider-Man, forget about trying to outrun the nimble Tar, whose refuge in the New Zealand Alps challenges both the markmanship and the footwork of Bill Ursaf. Yes! The Tar is a cousin to sheep and goats, native to the Himalayas, where it is listed as endangered. But it is thriving in the high peaks of New Zealand, where it was brought in 1904, and it is one of the most sought after game animals here. If you're looking for the one, you need to go where the hunting pressure is least, to the most inaccessible crags and mountaintops. A roaring blizzard forced Bill and the top tar man on Earth, Craig Dempster, to wait out the storm for some clear flying weather. One good thing the hunters knew for sure, any tracks they found would be fresh. The other major thing they knew, it was going to be a major slog. We're almost two miles high in the New Zealand Alps, somewhere in the range of nine to 10,000 feet. The snow that we're dealing with is a foot to two feet deep. It's not gonna be easy moving up here. We got thin air, we got deep snow, but we've got a motive. A healthy bull tar is waiting for us. Waiting for them may be a little bit of an exaggeration. How about doing their best to stay out of range? But there is one thing the hunters have going for them. At this altitude, predators of the tar only come from below. The best strategy is to stay above them. This country is just straight up, straight down. It's amazing that these things can move in such vertical areas. They've actually got a concave hoof. I think it helps them a lot. I don't want to misstate it, but it's maybe like almost like a suction cup. Helps hold. The way they run in vertical areas makes them the king of the mountains. I've never seen anything like it. Let's just see what we've got here, Bill. We'll stay up here. Yeah. Big mature bulls tend to run in packs this time of year. If Craig and Bill find such a group, it may hold the one. I've actually got a really nice bull in the scope right now. From here, he's probably 400 yards. Yeah, that's about 400 yards. But he's on the other side of those big rocks. Okay, so if we stick to the top of this ridge on the other side, sneak along, we're gonna be right above him. is blowing a huge cloud in. If we can't get this shot in before the cloud hits us, we're gonna lose these babies. I want you to come over my right hand shoulder. I'm gonna show you the bull tie you're gonna shoot, okay? See that big boy sitting down looking right at us? He's just turned his head uphill. Yeah, you see him? Yeah. That's the one you're gonna shoot. I'm on him. Okay, you got him? I'm on him. Got him. Got him. He's not stopping. Hey, no. Quick, Bill, go in, go in, go in. 
Okay, you got three on the skyline. Two below. Nice. In 20 years of hunting tar, Craig has never seen this many big boys at once. Question is, will it be more than a sighting? Bill and Craig have got a bearing on a pack of big bulls, but will the tar stay on course? And will it be within range of Bill's 30 odd six? What do you think the odds are that they're around this corner? They could be five yards over this ridge, they could be 20 yards over this ridge, we don't know, but we know they're over that ridge. There's their track. Lift your head up and you'll see them. See? Isn't that something? All right, just give me a minute, Bill, and let me work out which one we're going to take here. We have at least six really good bulls. I think we just found the one. The one you're looking at is the one that's right in the front. Locked and loaded. Put it right on his shoulder, Bill, any time, man. Right on him. Right on his shoulder. Watch him. This is a goal. Hooked him. Good shot. Good shot. I hope you enjoyed that episode. There's nothing more thrilling than hunting tar in New Zealand, high, high in the mountains. They came from the Himalayas originally, but they've just thrived here in New Zealand, and there's nowhere else on earth that has a population as healthy and as huntable as right here. If you're interested in hunting tar, you really should contact us so that we can line you up for fantastic hunting in the New Zealand Alps on the South Island. Get a hold of us, give us a phone call or go to www.horseandhunt.com, horseandhunt.com. We're from Horse and Hunt Adventures, where the adventures never end.